Kabbalah. This is not about religion. It's about science, ethics, and a new way to see reality. When we think of Beethoven creating his first symphony, or Michael Jordan effortlessly playing basketball, or a mother comforting her child, what energy are they tapping into? That is the exact energy Kabbalah is teaching us to access. The first rule of Kabbalah is that you can't always trust your five senses. They can be deceived. Right now, as you're watching this, there are light waves, television waves, and radio waves shooting past you. When someone speaks, sound waves are coming out of their mouth. Just because we don't see these energies doesn't mean that they don't exist. The atom, building block of the universe. It's nothing more than a tiny proton and an electron spinning around a nucleus. It's spinning so fast that it appears to be solid, when in fact, it's only 1% physical matter and 99% empty space. Since everything that we see is actually an illusion, Kabbalah teaches us how to perceive the 99% world, the world we don't recognize using our limited senses. One example of these hidden energies is the moon. It's generally known that the moon affects the ocean's tides. In reality, the moon affects all bodies of water. Since the human body is made up of more than 70% water, every cell in our body is in fact like a tiny ocean. We are affected by the moon's energy just like the ocean. By understanding Kabbalah's wisdom, we begin to see true reality. A single, perfectly balanced energy where happiness, health, and success are right there in front of us. A basic principle of Kabbalah states that less of something can actually be more. The evolution of computers and information processing has shown us how this principle affects all of us. Processing power that used to require an equipment-filled room now fits in the palm of your hand. Kabbalah also urges us to eliminate the process. Process is described as everything standing between you and what you want in life. Kabbalistically speaking, excess process equals chaos. We must learn to channel the energy of the universe to eliminate chaos and uncertainty from our lives. Kabbalah teaches us that we are restricted by our own desire to receive for ourself alone. By changing that desire into one of sharing, it is at that very moment that we are empowered by the 99% world and can realize true abundance. The noble act of sharing allows us to receive the energy in perfect balance. The universe was created in a moment. That means we can change it in a moment.